guys, it's Olivia Jade. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm probably doing one of my most requested videos literally in the world. Like, here we go, people. It's my skincare routine. I'm actually really excited to film it. And I have to disclaim that this is sponsored by Clinique because you guys know I'm very open about sponsorships. But when you see what's being sponsored, I think you're gonna be like, of course, she's obsessed with that product. So, I was like so excited about this since I've been using this product for like six months now. I mean, it's already empty, so I need to get another one. But yeah, if you guys want to see what I do every single day, it's how I remove my makeup, it's how I take care of my skin, it's how I keep it clear, then please keep watching and I hope you enjoy. So, the first thing I want to talk about is obviously how I remove my makeup. This is literally my ride or die. Like, I'm not saying this because this is sponsored by Clinique. I would straight up, I feel like you can tell too when sponsorships are genuine. This product is everything. It's empty too. Obviously when I'm out late at night at a party with my friends or whatever, my mom has always taught me, no matter what, don't go to sleep with your makeup on because you need to cleanse your face. And I don't want to do the whole makeup wipe, then face wash, and then moisturizer, and then whatever. This kind of does it all, if that makes sense, so I don't have to use a makeup wipe. I don't have to use my micellar water. I literally just use this, and then I usually just put moisturizer on. That's like a lazy night. If I'm feeling, you know, like, really get into my skin, I'll use this, and then I'll show you some other products that I use, but this is like the lazy girl's best friend, so if you know me, you know it's perfect. It doesn't feel greasy at all, it doesn't feel drying, it just kind of like transfers from like an oil to like a milky consistency. You're gonna see when I'm doing a little demo, but this is how I take my makeup off. I think everyone should get this. I'm literally not saying this because this video is in partnership with Clinique. I would say this anyway, because this is the greatest investment. I promise you, no doubt about it, you will thank me. I promise you will thank me. I literally can't stop talking about it. My sister used half of mine, which pissed me off, but whatever. It's amazing. If I'm feeling like, Olivia, you need to put a little bit more effort into your skincare, I will usually go in with, sorry, I was looking at my products, I will usually go in with a face wash. So you guys know my Ride or Die Forever has been my Lancer products. I mostly keep these in my shower now because this is the polish and this is the cleanse. And the polish is like a beady consistency and the cleanse is more of like a silky cleanser. So I start with the polish, I kind of like take the remainders off and then I go in with the cleanser. This is a great duo. It is a little bit pricey, but... Um, totally worth it in my book. I love Lancer products. These two products kind of have like taken over. Um, after I use my cleansing balm by Clinique, I usually go in with my fresh products. I've been loving these. So this is the Fresh Soy Face Cleanser. I love this because it's so gentle. So if you have sensitive skin and you just want like a nice gentle cleanser, I seriously recommend this. It hasn't broken me out at all. I really, really like it. It feels really hydrating. And I also have been using my Fresh Sugar Face Polish. Love this stuff because it's that beady consistency so it really feels like you're kind of scrubbing off all the dead skin cells. After that, obviously you need moisturizer, you need to kind of get that hydration back into your skin. I've been loving my Fresh Lotus Youth Preserve Face Cream. I just got this if you saw my last haul. This is so good. I'm literally obsessed with it. I think it's amazing. I think it's so lightweight and so hydrating, but at the same time you can really feel it like working into your skin. So I'm a really big fan of this. I also love my Fresh Rose Hydrating Eye Gel Cream. This is so soothing. I just take like my ring finger and I like kind of pat this under my eye and it feels amazing. Like it literally feels so refreshing. I'm I'm living for it, literally it's great, but I love both of these products together. I often find when I use the same brand together, it really works and mixes well, so a little trick, I don't know. And then for the nights where I'm like, I need my face to literally feel like when I wake up, it is going to be the most hydrated, the most alive it's ever been, I use this Charlotte Tilbury Magic Night Cream. This feels a little weird, I'm not gonna lie, when you first put it on your face. It's like, I can't explain it. It kind of feels like silicone-y, I guess. But you wake up and your skin like still looks like it has that fresh moisturizer on it. If you need deep hydration, like if your skin is struggling, I think you should try this. Last two things I wanna talk about. Um, my Fresh Rose Floral Toner. Don't scream that it's not Mario Badescu, okay? I still use that, but this has kind of been like what I've been using lately since spent my life savings on it. Just kidding, but um, it is pretty expensive. So if you're just wanting the cheap way out, Mario Badescu, same thing, it's great. It just, this is prettier packaging. That's literally it. And I just spray this on my face after I'm done with all my skincare. 
And then, if I'm having any breakouts, I will finish off with a little bit of my Mario Badescu rose water spray. No, my god, you are way too used to saying that. I will finish off with my Mario Badescu drying lotion. My last skincare routine, I used this and I shook it, and you're not supposed to shake it. So, I've learned my lesson. You just dip the Q-tip in and it's, it ruins actually the whole formula if you shake it. It doesn't even work, so don't shake it. Just put it on your little like blemishes, wherever you have a zit or two, and you'll be good to go in a few days. Thank you for watching. I love you, and I'll see you next time. Bye!